from WNY News, this is First Morning Weather. And welcome back everyone, well from sunny skies today to showers this afternoon. Now we are tracking some showers that are pushing on through this evening and these showers will remain in the forecast for your Wednesday. However, Thursday and Friday are looking like two pleasant days with lots of sunshine and our temperatures will be warming up rather considerably uh, by the end of the weekend. So this is our system that we are tracking. This, this low pressure is pushing those showers across our region and these showers are expected to remain on the light side for tonight and also tomorrow. Now we are tracking a cold front which is working its way in, in, through the Midwest. That would bring some more showers for tomorrow morning. And as a result, we are forecasting our morning high to be around 10 a.m. And we're forecasting a high around 56. However, right now our temperatures are ranging from the upper 40s to the lower 50s. 51 in Ridgebury, 53 in Tioga, 49 up at Penyan, 49 also in the Glen, and 53 in Tioga. So tomorrow will be a cloudy one with scattered showers in the morning. But by the time we get into the afternoon, drier weather conditions, cloudy skies, and cooler temperatures. And again, our high for tomorrow is likely to be just before noon. So winds will be a bit gusty with those gusts reaching about 25 miles per hour. And as that cold front slides to the east, our winds will come from the northwest and that will push cooler air over our region for Wednesday night. So rainfall totals will remain on the light side, generally less than a quarter of an inch through Wednesday morning. So as we head into Thursday, we are watching an area of high pressure which will dominate across our region, causing sunny skies. And these sunny skies are likely to persist into Friday. So again, Thursday and Friday are looking like two pleasant days. However, we are watching this warm front, which will likely lift into our region this weekend with some showers and thunderstorm. And that warm front will push warmer air into our area. As a result, by the end of the weekend, we could be dealing with temperatures in the 80s. Sunday, we are forecasting 80 degrees and maybe 84 by Monday. So Sunday will be a very warm day across the East Coast with temperatures in the 80s across much of our region. Tomorrow, we are forecasting the sunset to be around 7.59 p.m. Today, we forecasted a high near 70 degrees, but our actual high was 71. This is a look at the next seven days. Showers tonight with a low near 42 degrees. Showers are looking likely tomorrow morning with a high around 56. And watch much warmer by this weekend. I'm looking forward to those warmer temperatures. That'll be a nice change. Yeah, the warm air though will come with some showers and storms. Yeah. Now, it's time for some trivia. All right, let's hear it. Let's remind us. Well, today's question is about tornadoes and how many tornadoes does Pennsylvania average each year? The options are 45, 17, 5, and 33. I'm going to go with 17 based off of yesterday's. I feel like we don't have a lot of tornadoes in Pennsylvania. Bing, 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 bing. You oh, got it. Yeah. You actually got it. The correct answer is 17. And tornadoes are most common during the late spring and early summer. Huh, who knew? I'm glad I got it right. That's how exciting. All right. Thanks, Deshaun. Well, following the total solar eclipse in early April, the moon is making